Hi, this is Brent with Reprie. The purposes of this video will be to walk you through how to sign a document that has been sent to you from your realtor. When your realtor sends you a document for electronic signing, you will receive an email very similar to this. It will explain to you who it's from and have your realtor's name, and it will also have your name uh, in the top of the email. To begin the signing process, we just want to click on the View Documents button. The first screen that comes up here is a disclosure statement. If you go through and read this disclosure statement, it will just explain to you what an electronic signature is and how it works. Of course, because this is a legal document, you have to be okay with the electronic signing process to continue. If you are not, there is an option to sign on paper. If you click on that, this document will get printed for you with a fax cover sheet so that you can sign uh, in the traditional pen on paper signature. To continue on with the electronic signing process, we will consent to the disclosure statement and select the review document button. Once in the document, you will notice a yellow start button or next button in the top left hand corner. Clicking on that will scroll you down to the first spot that your realtor identified you needed to sign or initial this document. In this case, it's an initial. To begin the signing, all we have to do is click in the box. This will bring up a signature adoption screen. There will be two options for how to get your signature. One is to select a style, and in this case it's actually already given me a style. There is a number of predefined signature styles that you can choose from by clicking the Change Style button. Although this may not look exactly like your pen on paper signature, by selecting one, you're acknowledging that for the purposes of this electronic document, it will represent your pen on paper signature. If you are on a mobile touchscreen device, when you get to the Adopt Your Signature page, it will default to this Draw style. This will allow you to draw your signature with your finger. If you would like to draw this from your laptop or desktop computer with your mouse, you can also do that. In this case, I'm just going to select a signature style and click the Adopt and Initial button. This has now inserted my initial in the spot my realtor identified for an initial. We can click the Next button, and it will scroll me to the next spot my realtor identified I needed to sign a document. We have already adopted our signature style, so by clicking in this box, it will automatically insert that signature style for us. And in this case, because I've completed everything, it's giving me the option to confirm signing. I will need to do this to acknowledge that this document is completely signed and initiate the send back to the realtor. Once I click the confirm signing button, our document is now signed. If you do see a screen like this, you do not have to put anything into it. You can simply close it out and your realtor has automatically now received that signed copy of the document. You will also receive an email copy uh, momentarily with the PDF document attached to it for your own records as well. If you have any additional questions about electronic signatures, please feel free to contact your realtor and they should be able to provide you any information you require. Thank you.